this is Natalie at Coder CrossFit Native going over Saturday's workout. We've got two parts today, part A. You've got eight sets of some different bench or of some tempo bench press. Then part B, you've got five rounds of just a nice aerobic session, breathing, getting super sweaty. So part A is going to take you 12 minutes. Part B will take you about 24 minutes. If you have to stagger some people, it might take 25. Um, so that's a total of 36 minutes. You got lots of time to really get them warmed up for some bench press and maybe even a good day to do some handstand walking drills, either against the wall or out in the wild, um, bring a little bit of different value to your coaching. So let's we'll start with A, eight sets, three bench press going every 90 seconds. You're at 65 to 75%. Keep them on that low range of 65% um, until they can really hold that tempo. Once they hold the tempo, maybe they can go closer to 75. Tempo is gonna be three seconds down, one, two, Three, make sure they give you a real second pause, one pause on the chest, and then they explode up. If they keep that tempo, have them add some weight throughout those eight sets. Okay, part B, you get to split people up wherever, so you'll have um, everything kind of spread out across your gym. We've got a 55 to 65% row, some burpee box overs, uh, 55 to 65% assault bike, and handstand walking or bear crawling. Don't underestimate the bear crawl, that'll be super tough for those of us that those are the people that are not going upside down. We're really trying to keep these percentages there so they can't get too hot on the burden box overs or that handstand walk bear crawl. So they need to be scaled down to where they can keep their percentages there. As far as warming people up, really spend some time getting them in good shoulder positions on their bench press. Banded stuff, um, different T-spine rotation things. And then, you know, if we also kind of work on some handstand walking drills, that turns into like some shoulder prehab, rehab stuff too wall walk, shoulder taps, and things like that. So they should feel, be feeling really loose and good, opening those shoulders before they start their bench press. All right? Then you'll have a little bit of time here to get everybody set up, make sure everybody knows what they're doing, and then have your class. So have some fun. Saturday after uh, some Christmas stuff, people will just want to sweat and have a good time.